here with women's soccer coach Neil Cassidy. Coach, great start to the season. Uh, a big win on uh, last Friday and then a tough, heartbreaking loss to uh, to Ripon on Sunday. Talk a little bit about those two games. Uh, really, so many positives to, to take out of both of those games. Oh, for sure. I think that was the biggest thing this week and we were looking for is what positives can we take out? And there were, there were a lot. Um, the first game took us a while to find our feet. Once we did, I think we have we pretty much dominated and and, uh, and played really well. It was it was phenomenal to see how everybody was gelling together just for our first game. Um, second game we knew it was going to be a little bit tougher as they were kind of ranked, I think, fourth in our region last year. Um, but I mean, it was a tight, tight game going to overtime, and it was just one of those things that didn't quite go our way. Um, but again, with that, a lot of positives um, that came out of that particular game um, in terms of our style of play and knowing that we can we can compete with some of the best in our region. Let's talk a little bit about the Lawrence game, a nice 4-0 win. I think when I looked at the score sheet, the thing that really popped out to me was four goals, four freshmen scored, about well, three freshmen because Mary Loy had two of them. That's got to be encouraging for you in that in that these these younger players – first collegiate games, and yet they're playing like veterans rather than maybe a little bit uh, nervous or whatnot. Uh, did that surprise you at all? No, it's credit to our team. Absolutely 100% credit to the rest of the players on the team that have made them feel so welcome and have allowed them to kind of express themselves on the field and have been supportive of that, as well as uh, bringing them up when they made mistakes. So I think that's a testament to the culture that we've got within the team this year. And 100% um, it was our... It was our the rest of the team that made them feel welcome. You got a busy week this week. You're uh, finally going to kick off the home part of your season on on uh, Wednesday against Bethany Lutheran, and then you've got the uh, this, the tournament this weekend where you'll face uh, Finlandia on Friday, and then uh, the winner or loser of uh, Nebraska Wesleyan and Martin Luther. Talk a little bit about the week because this is really a kind of a crammed part of your schedule in that you go Friday, Sunday, Wednesday, and then Friday and Saturday. Uh, obviously, you made the schedule uh, intent on that. Yeah, just to get us geared up, get a lot more games in before our conference. Um, and also, I think uh, I think last time we spoke, the, one of the things was to give us a bit of a break when we may need it in, co in conference. So, yeah, it was, it was intentional. I knew we'd have a good class coming in. I knew we could handle the schedule. And um, I'm really excited to open up at home tomorrow. And uh, I think it'll be... I think it'll be good. You know, without giving away tacticals, because I know you don't like to do that, but tomorrow night against Bethany Lutheran, what can we expect from the Cardinals? Because nobody has seen them play unless they were on the road with you guys, but uh, what, what are we looking for? What's going to be the, the flavor of the Cardinals this year? Flavor is going to be the same as the first two games, so... If you didn't see them, come support us and watch how and see how we're going to be playing uh, tomorrow. 7 o'clock, Wednesday night against Bethany Lutheran. Good luck, Coach. Thank you.